having anxiety, depression, stress, getting nervous, these are things that are absolutely nothing to be ashamed of. There's no blame here. And chances are if you suffer, and I use the word suffer, you suffer from conditions where you're, you're so stressed, you're so wound up, you're so exhausted from anxiety or stress or depression, it mightn't actually be your fault. First of all, blaming doesn't help, as I've discussed before. But secondly, you mightn't have never been given or taught the skills for how to cope with your feelings, how to cope with stress, how to cope with overwhelm. You might have never been taught these feelings. In the same way that you absolutely wouldn't put me near the engine of a car, you just don't have the skill set. Or you just were in an environment where it's very, very stressful for you now. We're not to say that environmental factors and external factors don't count. Uh, but you probably don't have a lot of impact over right now about what your work or family obligations are, what the government do, climate, etc., etc. What is in your responsibility is learning how to take care of yourself, learning how to manage your mindset, learning how to soothe your emotions, learning how to make your actions that tiny, tiny fraction of a percentage better each day. That is within your control. Not saying all the other things don't matter, and your environment absolutely matters. What I'm saying is you have a responsibility to take care of yourself and to learn how to take care of yourself.